What's going on guys? Today I'm going to show you my G Fuel collection. What's going on everyone? So happy you clicked on this video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys my G Fuel collection. So um, let's get right to it. First we have Strawberry Banana. You see, and this is a packet here. But this is my favorite packet that I saved. I've sadly drank it. But I love the Strawberry Banana. If you look at that up close. I love Strawberry Banana, but since KSI left G Fuel to go to Prime, which I don't know about you guys, but if you've tried Prime, but me personally, I don't really like it. It's got like some weird acid or something in it. I don't know. Probably the reason why I don't like most other energy drinks because of the amino acids and I can actually taste that and they taste weird, but G Fuel does not have none of that. Go with this is the stickers. I got two G Fuel stickers. They're both the same. This one came with my recent BOGO order. And this one right here. This one, I don't know if y'all can see that. It was kind of bent. That came with my Mango Lemonade order, which if you want to watch that video, click here. Um, So let's get right into it. So the first can we have here is Peach Rings. Actually... This was the very first G Fuel can I bought. As you can see, sadly, I removed that top thing, so it's not in like mint, mint condition. But you can see here, G Fuel. There we go. You know, you can see both ways. See across there. There's Sonic the Hedgehog on it. See all that. And then. Where does it say? Oh, it's performance energy, zero sugar, extreme focus. You can see all that on the side there. Doesn't have the uh, the ones like the tubs do where it's the energy, focus, endurance, or whatever they have on the tubs there. But yeah, so these is probably the most popular can as well. I've found them all kinds of places. I think I, I got this one from Quick Trip. So most quick trips out there have these. In Oklahoma, anyway. I don't know about around everywhere else. But my rating on this would probably be, let's say, 8.5 out of 10. I really like this can. Probably one of my favorites. All right, now for probably my favorite can. This is one of my favorite flavors, too. Orange Vibe. Look at that. Now this is a cool can design as well. It's got the black and orange stripes. Kind of looks like a tiger print almost. But then it's got, you know, dreamsicles there and then oranges, the G Fuel oranges. But zero sugar, extreme focus, performance, energy, all that. Cool can. I would probably rate this a 9.5 out of 10. Or no. A 9.6 out of 10. I really like this. This is probably my favorite can. And on my tier list, on my tub tier list, this is my second favorite flavor. Blue Bomber Slushy. Now this, for all the 90s kids out there, I know I'm not a 90s kid, but this guy right here probably gives you some memories. Mega Man is an OG video game. Blue Bomber Slushy. I, I actually really like this. I'm going to give this an 8.7 out of 10. So pretty high ratings, but there will be some lower ones later. All right, the next one is Ninja Cotton Candy. Ninja Cotton Candy. Same thing pretty much. Oh, this one has the energy, focus, endurance, and reaction on it across there it's got ninja tyler ninja blevins on there this one ninja cotton candy i'm not a big cotton candy flavor guy um still has that smell to it uh this one it was okay i'd probably give it a seven out of ten next one we have is pewdiepie see PewDiePie's there. 
This is also a very popular one I see a lot of places at Quick Trip and Walmart and of course GFuel.com. Um, PewDiePie. Let's see there. I don't think his has the um, energy, focus, endurance, and reaction. No, it doesn't. But PewDiePie, this can, you know, it was like a lingon berry, I think is what it is. Something like that. Kind of seems kind of weird to me. It was okay, but not my favorite. I'd probably give this 6.5 out of 10. Baysberry. Now this one, this can has become more rare. I haven't seen this can many places in a while. Like this is starting to go out. It used to be popular in just about in every quick trip you go to, but I haven't found one of these in a while. Baysberry, real good flavor, inspired by face. You can see there, table of contents. Oh, it does have the um, energy, focus, endurance, and reaction on there as well. Um, phase berry, good. Usually, and usually, that's why G feels so like great because sometimes I like it, sometimes I don't. Their flavoring is different than most flavorings, but usually I don't like berry flavor. But this phase berry is an exception. This is good. I'd probably give it a 8.3 out of 10. Um, I got another peach rings. This one's a nicer one. As you can see, the lid isn't popped off like the other one. But it's not my first, you know, can. The other one was my very first can I ever bought. But this one, I just bought so it could look nicer. You already heard my peach rings thing. Um, sour Chug Rug. Inspired by rug. Um, and see here. Now, can art. This one looks really cool. Flavor wise, sour blue chug rug. Not a big fan. I don't like really blue raspberry very much. And so, this sour blue raspberry. I mean, it was okay. Probably my least favorite can. I mean, I don't know. I would give this can a... I don't even know what to give it. Say 5.8. That's my lowest rating. I mean, probably my least favorite can. Next one is Sage Mode. Sage Mode is delicious. It is a white peach citrus i think this flavor was delicious and the tub of this is really good as well i would give this a i'd say i'd give this a hmm. i'd say i give this an 8.7 out of 10. pretty good Last, but not least, actually, maybe least, no. Radioactive Lemonade. Radioactive Lemonade. Now, the design art is 10 out of 10 design art because it has Spider-Man on it. And I love Spider-Man. So, awesome art there. Um, yeah. This one, I don't know. I don't really care for it too much. Probably give it 5.9 out of 10. This one, for some reason, didn't taste like lemonade like at all to me. It just had a weird flavor. And maybe this was a bad can. I don't know. You guys comment down below what you think of radioactive lemonade. But my personal experience with it, it was okay. It didn't really taste like a lemonade like I'd much rather have a mango lemonade or something like that because that I could actually taste the lemonade in it where this couldn't and it's supposed to be only or not only lemonade but I couldn't taste any lemonade it was just the other flavor I'm sure they mixed in it 
I don't know. I'll look it up. What's what else is in here? But didn't really like it. All right, now it's time to move on to my tubs. Now my tubs, I only have four. I know it's kind of small, but they're four of my favorites. And my tier list, you can look at like fave. All four are up there. I actually think one is in the good category, but um, and I'm making if I don't already have a review video for these flavors, I'm making it. So I'm not telling you my rating. First one, I will tell you this one, is my all-time favorite flavor, Miami Nights. Now, a little bit about me. I love pina colada. And I also really like um, pina colada flavoring. And I also really like strawberry. And they put the two and two together, G Fuel did, and... I have this just about every day, if not every other day. Definitely my personal favorite. You see, it's number one on my tier list as of this video. But as of right now, it's my favorite. Um, next is Snow Cone. Now, if I don't already have one uploaded, I'm making a video about Snow Cone why I like it so much because I know for some people you know it may be your favorite but it's not a very popular like favorite flavor well the reason why I like it so much and I still do it still is really one of my favorites like taste wise and everything but the reason why it's one of my favorites and stuff is because this was the very first G Fuel I ever had yes guys just because of the nostalgia of it and everything snow cone one of my favorites. Next, Mango Lemonade. Inspired by Shock, which if you don't know who he is, he is probably the best G Fuel YouTuber. I highly recommend checking him out. Um, he has a discount code for G Fuel, so code Shock all the way to make a discount to get this flavor especially. You gotta use his code for his own flavor. But Mango Lemonade. Now this, unlike Radioactive Lemonade, this, I can actually taste the perfect mixture of lemonade and mango. And it's just, mmm, so good. And I've already rated this too. You've seen this flavor on the tier list. I've reviewed it before. You can go watch that video right here. And yeah, delicious. Last, but certainly not least, is Peach Rings. As you can see, Sonic the Hedgehog's on there as well. Peach Rings is delicious. I love Peach Rings. I love the Peach Ring candy. G Fuel Peach Rings tastes just like it. Looks like you took that Peach Ring candy, turned it into a liquid, and you got this. Or actually turned it into powder. But, so good. Love Peach Rings. I've also been thinking about doing a Does It G Fuel, mixing this with Mango Lemonade. What do you guys think? Comment down below what you guys think. Thank you guys once again for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.